What's up guys, it's Kara here, and I've been on a roll with my single serve protein goodies. So today what I'm gonna make for you is a single serve sugar cookie. And to do this, it's gonna be easy because we are just gonna pop it in the microwave for 50 seconds and be done with it. So not a lot of ingredients, not a lot of preparation. So to get started, all you're gonna need is a bowl, and you are gonna wanna have a paper plate on the side that I've just put some parchment paper on it and that's what we're gonna cook the cookie on. So first we're gonna mix in our bowl uh, one whole egg and we're gonna go ahead, crack that baby in there and whisk it up. So once you've got your egg all whisked up, we're gonna add in some flour and use whatever kind you like. I'm gonna use my whole wheat flour and we're just gonna add three tablespoons of that. I like using the whole wheat versus white because it then ups the fiber content and you really can't tell a difference so between this or white. And then to sweeten it, you guys can add whatever you like. I'm gonna use Splenda. I'm gonna add in there one kind of heaping tablespoon. Now for the protein to make it taste very sugar cookie-like, I'm gonna use the vanilla MTS weight protein. This one all on its own tastes just like a sugar cookie. I've always been disappointed with other vanilla proteins and no joke, MTS Way nailed the vanilla. Tastes just like a sugar cookie. So I'm not gonna use a whole scoop. We're just making one cookie, you guys. It will make the consistency too weird. So I actually measured out 12 grams, which is roughly about a third of a scoop. Um, and remember, we're also getting protein from the egg as well. So that's in there. The next thing we're gonna add is a little bit of fat to this. So I'm adding a tablespoon of butter or whatever it is I have here, Brummel and Brown. It's like a yogurt butter, but use butter or whatever you have. You could use oil as well, but I think butter goes best for like the sugar cookie flavor. So I've got one tablespoon of that. Um, this one, since it is a yogurt base, is only five grams of fat, so nutritionals will be based on that. Um, Looks kind of funky, but I've got it melted in here. I'm gonna go ahead and dump that into our mixture. Making sure I get all of it. And last couple of things we're gonna do is just a little bit of sea salt, or salt, whatever you got. A couple cranks in there. And last thing is some pure vanilla extract. I'm gonna add a fourth of a teaspoon, because I usually never measure this and end up dumping half the bottle in there. All right, and now we're just gonna go ahead and mix that all up. So once you've got your batter all mixed up, I'm gonna go ahead and just use a spatula to kind of form this into a cookie on the plate. Remember, it's kind of gonna take on its own shape in the microwave since we're not containing it in like a cookie cutter or something like that. Um, we're just gonna plop it on there, smooth it out into a cookie, and Throw it in the microwave for 50 seconds and we should be good to go. All right guys, 50 seconds in the microwave and you are gonna wanna let it sit for just like a minute. I leave it in the microwave before I pull it out just so everything can kind of settle. And then you end up with this big, massive cookie. Like I said, it kind of takes on its own shape a little bit, but it's pretty big, pretty dense. And you guys can whip this up nice and easy and enjoy sugar cookie guilt-free. You could add some sprinkles to it, but I happen to be out. But there is your individual 50 second sugar cookie. I hope you guys enjoy. Keep checking back for more.